My name is Gabrielle Kelly and I studied biomedical biology. I entered right out of high school in 2011 and right away my first year I noticed a huge difference between high school and uh, university. I was already struggling with depression and anxiety but I never felt it to this degree before. I failed my first class uh, in first semester so I failed calculus and that was a huge turning point for me. I realized that like failure is real whereas in high school it's not. From there I went to my second year, I failed another class and then I ended up choosing to drop out. In 2014, I came back. At that point, I was in between my second and third year, and then in between my third and fourth year, and then finally I finished my fourth year in 2018. I was really struggling uh, with my depression and suicidal ideation. Um, in 2014, I had actually made an attempt on my life. That resulted in me having 16 stitches on my wrist. I still have a nasty scar from that one. That kind of reminds me every day of what I did. So I received a diagnosis in 2015 after I made the attempt on my life. We realized there were counseling services on campus. So um, at that point I was in crisis, so I was able to get in right away. My diagnosis is fourfold, a major depressive disorder, borderline personality disorder, post-traumatic stress disorder, and attention deficit disorder. Um, and so those combined were able to give me a prescription for antidepressants. I tried a couple of different combinations because it's not always a one-size-fits-all kind of situation. From there, I was able to come back to school and really focus on what I wanted to do. It really feels surreal to me that I'm actually graduating. Um, because I've been at Laurentian since 2011, it's taken me seven years to get a four-year degree. So it really feels like it's not real. It's exciting, but until I'm walking across that stage in that gown, I, I won't register for me. I'm open like this to students out there who struggle just because I want them to know that they're not alone and that um, suffering from mental health issues don't make you a worse person. They make you stronger. They make you more resilient. People who fall down and get back up are so much stronger than the people who've never fallen and it's hard to realize that when you're in the midst of turmoil.